What if someone goes on with their symptoms and says, well, I can deal with this diarrhea or this discomfort, um, and they don't get treatment or they don't alter their lifestyle? Are there mm -hmm. any long-term problems that could result? Well, there are, unfortunately. Um, so there are nutritional deficiencies that can occur. Um, so if your intestine is injured, it means that you're not absorbing uh, your nutrients well um, because that's where the nutrients get absorbed. So um, you can obviously lose weight, and those are long-term consequences. In, um, and um, you can become, uh, most importantly, iron deficient. So you may be anemic, uh, having a low blood count, and, um, and the risk of osteoporosis. So you have decreased absorption of calcium and vitamin D. You may have decreased absorption of vitamin K and have maybe some clotting abnormalities. So there are long-term nutritional problems that can occur. Um, the other part of it is that there is this sort of unknown risk of um, gastrointestinal cancers years afterwards in patients who are untreated for celiac disease. The thought being that this sort of um, this immune reaction and inflamed intestine that has gone on for years that ultimately there are changes that can occur that uh, could be malignant. So um, that's one of the main reasons for trying to um, fix things early on as opposed to waiting.